Oh, hello and welcome to Writer's Block, an indie horror game? I think. Let's get into it. Controls. Is that paper boat? Uh, A, walk left, D, walk right, toggle full screen, no thank you. Uh, phone menu? Okay, at least escape is not insta-alt-fucking-f4, that's good. Show, uh, hold shift to run and left click to interact, sure. I just have to remember never to hit T and hit escape if I need B. As I enter the lobby of the standard occasion, the smell of hickory and ginger waft over me. It is a small room, likely a living room before, before it, hmm, before it got changed, but it still remains, but it still retains its fisherman roots. No, no, that's not it. That book is distracting me. Burn it! Just burn the book! I can't focus right now. Oh, it's a point-and-click game. Empty. Nothing good is ever on. Just another pair of jeans and jacket. This fucking microphone is seriously like... This is the little stub that's in my way at the bottom of the screen. It's a little bit bugging me. But it's like the best position I can have the microphone right now. Uh, let's see. It reminds me of my college days. 6.20 p.m. Twinkle by Ray Gibson. Twinkle. What a terrible title, Ray. At least he signed it to me. I suppose I owe him a chapter. In green pen, even, to my bestest friend. Thanks for coming. Bestest friend? Was it like, literal, like a bro? Like a, a not a bro, but a friend of his wrote the book and he's distracted by it? Huh? The screeching squeal of metal on metal screams in my ears. That was every agonizing cliche crammed into two pages. Yet, this garbage is a bestseller. His audience must be the most asshiny, common masses of a- oh, no, no, I need to put this away and focus on my writing. Wow. I mean, the game's called Writer's Block, so... We could basically say... He's a jealous person who... I mean, you just have to look at the environment. He's living in a shitty apartment room. I mean, even the, like, the, it's just like a greasy looking. Nothing else. He's miserable, he has a writer's block, he read his friend's book, he's succeeding, and he's going to be blaming everything but himself, you know? Uh, okay, so... Sleep? Sleep on it? N nothing else? Actually, that gives me an idea. Once inside, I can hear the call of the ocean. Innkeeper, Mrs. Glady. Glady? Glady? Let's say Glady. Oh, what? Glady? The G-Lady? Let's go Glady. Fuck it. Is not present. I need to find a way to get her attention. Oh. Smash something? A novelty lamp caught between Kish and Avant-Garde? What? A well-crafted helm made from redwood. I wonder where they found that. I don't know, the antique store? Why the fuck does it matter? Must be Miss Mr. Gladys. Oh, Gladys? Okay. Keys. It seems the three rooms are already occupied. Oh. Um, then where am I clicking? Where do you want me to go? Oh wait, never mind. We can move. Fuck me. I forgot about it. Postcards. Huh? Upstairs? I shouldn't rudely go further unannounced. Uh, is there a bell? Ah, I'm coming, dear. There we go. I'm going to be the one rude-ass son of a bitch. Sorry I had to rush you out like that by ringing the bell 50 times, even though you have a, a walker. You didn't need to ring it that much, dear. Uh, I heard you the first time. Sorry, ma'am. It's alright, as long as you don't do it again. Oh, actions speak louder than words, you know. My phone is vibrating? No. Can you grab it? Oh, escape. Ray. Oh. Hey man, you're missing out on an after party. One of the fans brought me her to a restaurant, and let me tell you, the food is out of this world. Who would have guessed that a Mission Star chef is a Twinkle fan? Hey man, are you still there? Hello? <laughs> I 
I can't focus right now. Just, housekeeping is gonna hate me. Oh, just, apparently we're just in that world where we're writing a book about how obnoxious we were about ringing the bell 50 fucking times and uh, trying to make a book on that. wonder if I'll look better with a mustache. Eh, probably not. I can't leave yet. So what, what, do, you, what do you want? What, what do you want? I'm down to the last bottle. Maybe drinking that much is not a good fucking thing. What do you want me to do now? Call? Wonder if I'll look better. Oh no, no, I'm not looking at the mirror, but sure. Quit? No. Save? This is, I guess, just a demo, so there's more to come, but I just want to know what this guy wants. So I turn off the light, where I can just keep doing this. But nothing happens, unlike the... Oh, what's that? What's that other game I'm thinking about now? Shit. I'm here too? I'm here, I think. You know, the game I can flip off a light switch repeatedly and then I die. I was hoping that maybe something would happen, but apparently not. What the fuck does this guy want me to do? He says he can't focus. And I can turn off the light, but he doesn't want to sleep. He doesn't want to leave. Nothing good is ever on. This guy's so fucking miserable. He doesn't want to fucking sleep. It's 9.38 p- It's 9.38 p.m. Go to fucking sleep. What do you want me to do? I can't click the call button. Because he thinks he's still looking at the fucking mirror. So hopefully it's nothing to do with the phone call. I seriously have been clicking everywhere, sir, for just so long now. I think- This is just level one demo. But since it's literally a demo, you'd presume there would be- there'd be an ending. It would just, wouldn't just sort of be an incomplete project that just ends abruptly because you can't go any further. That would be more akin to an alpha, I would say. But the fact that anything in this room I've clicked, I've had it so this is off. This is, this is a horror game in a way too, as a reminder, because the trailer looks completely fucking awesome, uh, as I reminded myself when I checked the game store page. But I've tried almost every kind of combination I can think of. He says he can't leave yet. You can't focus. The drawer is just jeans. The beer bottles. The window. Uh, leaving the TV on. Light off. Staring at the window for a certain amount of time. And the fucking air vent. Or trying to open this door. This door just has absolutely no... No response. So I'd presume I'm meant to go through this fucking door. But... Like this one, it says I can't leave yet. But this door... I can't open. I'm not sure if it's a bug, but I seriously have clicked everywhere. So I might have to prematurely end this unless the developer himself can say, oh yeah, maybe it's broken or I'm doing something wrong or that this is the actual end because I'd like to continue playing more. I'll, I'll show you guys the trailer to the game so you guys can see what potential I saw in the game for me to download to try this game because I don't think anyone else has played this. I tried looking on Google and YouTube for writers block the game. I don't see anyone else playing this, but the trailer looks really nice. So I'll play the trailer. Uh, hopefully the developer doesn't get upset at me doing that because I want to show people what potential this game has and me playing this demo if it is broken. If something is broken, then hopefully I can get it fixed so I can finish it. But nonetheless, I don't know how I'm supposed to progress through this game. He says he can't focus. I can't enter the right room. And nothing sort of happens. So, I'm going to leave it here. I'll play the trail. Hopefully, the developer won't get upset. Outside of that, I'm just going to leave it here. So, hopefully, you enjoyed this and you enjoy the trailer that I'll play. And then afterwards, it's just, I, it's, that's just the end of it for now. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like, comment, hit that subscribe button, become a full subscriber, hit that bell notification down below for updates on my videos. Thank you for watching. Until the next time. <laughs>